Hi, Dean Crabb from C2 Solutions here. In my last video, I had someone ask, how do you do that? How do you get your mobile phone to display on your PC screen? So today I'm going to give you that secret, and it has lots of uses in business. So I hope you like it. Now, what may not seem very obvious at first, there's lots of business uses for displaying your phone to your PC or to display. So I just want to run through some of those quickly. One of them is capturing a screenshot. In certain devices, in certain apps, you can't do that. So to be able to push your, your phone up to your PC and grab it with like Snagit or Jing is really handy. The other one is troubleshooting. People can often go, oh, I don't know where to find that in the menu. Again, you can grab it and on your screen and, and show the person. Screen sharing is not a, a common one you'd think of, but it's actually one I've done a lot. If you're screen sharing or someone's actually looking at your screen, you can bring your phone up on your computer and show it. And so they can be looking and viewing that from anywhere in the world. It's really handy to remotely teach someone something. Staff training is a really obvious one in the business setting because phones are so prolific in business now. Throw your phone up onto your PC and just be able to show the team how to do something. Presentations is another really obvious one in the business setting. Um, in most boardrooms, there's a display with uh, a computer attached and you can then present your phone up there if you need to, to sell something to the board. Webinars and videos is also a really common one, um, just like I'm doing now. Okay, so let's dive in and show you. But before I do, I just wanna show you the things you'll need to be able to make this work. So I've got a phone here, but it can be iPhone or Android. Okay, you've got a computer or a desktop and a monitor. Now normally your monitor would be connected to your laptop or desktop with the HDMI port and a cable. Okay, so you need to, if you're gonna push it along the bottom here and around to the monitor, you need some software and that's Reflector 2. Reflector 2 is what I'm gonna show you today. It's quite cheap and it allows you to display that up into the screen. Okay, AirPower is another tool that allows you flexibility to pretty much display anything anywhere. So it's really, really quite handy. If you want to go the cordless fashion, go and get yourself a Chromecast. It's $50. It plugs into the HDMI port of your monitor and you get the Chromecast app. And um, using that, you push it through to the display. Okay, so if you've got a PC involved, you need this software. So let's go and show you that now. Okay, so down the bottom here, you'll see this little icon down here. That's my Reflector 2 app, and I'm already casting my phone to it. And Air Parrot is the other tool, and I'll show you that in a moment. So let's bring over my phone. So you'll see there I've got the Chromecast app. Okay, so on Android devices, depending on the model, there's different ways. Modern ones, you use the Chromecast app. So you open Chromecast, in the menu, go Screen, Cast, and Audio. Okay. And then down the bottom where it says tap to disconnect, you get a screencast and audio button. You click that and it'll show the devices you can push to. So mine, I get my computer name and I get my TV screen, okay? So that's one way. On older devices, um, you want to look for this screen mirroring option you got in the top middle or the quick connect. And they also will allow you to push um, your, those devices through. Okay, so that's my Android phone. If I bring up the iPhone, Okay, so on iPhone, all you need to do is swipe from the bottom up and see where it says Neo down there? That usually says AirPlay. You click on that, okay, and you get um, the devices that are enabled to be able to receive. You click Neo, turn on monitoring, and then go done, and the phone will just appear, okay? Again, you can get the Chromecast app for the iPhone if you want to push to a Chromecast. So down here on the reflector tool, you've got this device. You can actually then record it and you can also broadcast it out to YouTube. So really, really some cool features that become enabled through this um, application. And if you look at the Air Parrot, you can see there in the top half, the Air Parrot allows you pretty much to display anything to anywhere. I can pick any of my displays on my computer and then push it out down the bottom half to my lounge room TV or my computer. So it gives really flexible ways of pushing um, what you're seeing to different devices. And lastly, on the phone, if you look in the top right corner there, I've got the Reflector 2 app, okay, up there. And that allows you to be able to push your iPhone 
onto your Android device or other devices onto your Android device. So it kind of reverses the process. So with Reflector 2, Air Parrot by Squirrel, and these apps and a Chromecast device, you can pretty much display anything anywhere. So I hope you found that really helpful and look forward to seeing you next time. So we hope you enjoyed that tech tip from C2 Solutions. Be sure to subscribe to our mailing list. You'll find the link below or on our website. Give the video a like so it gets a bit of a boost and be sure to share it with your friends and colleagues. We look forward to seeing you next time.